Alright, I'm sorry if the next cutscene, the previous cutscene could not be watched. There's a reason for that. It's the like copyrights of YouTube and all. Because you basically see naked ladies and have sex with them and they don't allow that. So I'm sorry if you couldn't see it. I could. But basically they told like the main part of Kratos' story for the game and it's killing a god. Killing the god of war. They also said that he what like served the god for 10 fucking years and he's sick of it and he wants to get rid of the horrors of his past and all that and it's well maybe she can tell you that. Destroy Ares and the gods will forgive you your past. Yeah, that's basically what she said in the cutscene. And those guys are the simplest enemies after the ones we just encountered before. Only that they have better defense. Yeah, so you can grab them anytime you want. You gotta wait till there's that circle of the hands. But it's all worth it. Oh. Ooh, damn. Fuck you. But you can still do that though. So, uh, who here still thinks, or like something like that? Who here thinks, think, who here thinks that the game stinks? Nobody? Well, I hope. Those are people, then you suck. Okay. Running around. Toma shorna. I have no idea what just saying there. God. I hate you. I hate you so badly for what you just did. You attack me. You dare, like, touch my sensitive skin. Wow, that sounded really gay. Chist. And it's a phoenix feather. You need six of them to uh, get higher, higher magic level. It's always worth it. Even if it brings you back or like makes you die a hundred thousand times before you can actually get it, it's always worth it. Jump, jump. Lover old. And we are about to encounter one of my favorite enemies of the game. Or at least favorite in the other God of War games, because in this game they're okay, but I don't like them as much in this game. Yeah. In this game, they're not my favorite enemies. Even though that's... Wow! Yeah, don't worry. Let me reassure you, right now, when you fight them, they're nowhere as fast as that. They're best in normal speed. I remember they did be a bit faster though. What did you just do? Ooh. So this, in other games, is my favorite way of killing the Minotaurs. In this game, I don't like it as much. Mainly because it's poorly made. Like, you only get health when you do that, nothing more. That's what I find sad, because otherwise it's really an awesome move. What what did you just do? Oops. 
Oops, that was a fail. Ah, uh, there's another one. Ha! <laughs> you suck! So you see, I do that because it's... I like to see you. And then they die up in front of you. They're already dead. Hit! Hit! No. That's not what I need to do. Yeah, you do can bring them up. Isn't that awesome? No, I'm not gonna do it this time. Cause I got full health. There we go. So they don't give you a lot of orbs, but it's orbs. Whether you get a lot or not, it's always better than nothing. Always. Oops, wrong move. Because I get confused between the con control the controls between God of War One and the other God of War. Because in this game the controls are kind of messed up in terms of like grabbing important stuff and all that junk. Can get it. Okay, good enough. Ooh. That was bloody. And the earth just trembled. You know, oh my god, it's a cyclo. Those guys, I think, are actually my favorite enemies of the game. Even though they always make my life a pain. <laughs> See how powerful they are, but how satisfying that is. Yeah, they kept, they basically kept the same killer move during the whole series. And they give you a lot of orders. But they always make your life a pain. Because otherwise the game wouldn't be, wouldn't be as fun. I mean, you gotta have... A game is... Like, whatever I'm gonna say, I don't know what I'm gonna say. Just... Look... At that. I just find it satisfying. And oh my god, there's a second one. I hate that move. Vow! Piece of shit. Eat my balls. Oh, wait. What the hell did I just say? Did I just say eat my balls? No, just die a painful and horrible death. It's gonna be enough. Yeah, so hitting the right button at the right time is actually harder than it looks. But I do it easy. Because I'm the beast. Actually, there's another type of uh, cyclope, and it's really hard to hit the right button at the right time because you got exactly three, not even the quarter of a second to hit the right button. I'm not kidding, you don't have time at all. Hey, go down faster. Oh, wait, what the hell did you see? Oh, I thought there was something good down here. Eight minutes already? <gasps> better hurry, better hurry, better hurry, better hurry. In case you haven't noticed, I like to sing. Yeah, I do that. Otherwise, you get stuck. I got stuck here for like five minutes the first time I used to play. And there we go. We are no longer stuck in there. So, jump. Oops. No. Oh, I hate not having this. Because since God of War 2, in God of War 2 and 3, there's a very efficient system of gliding with wings that you ripped off from somebody. You'll see that when we get to God of War 2, which is probably not very soon. Jump, jump, grab, jump, jump, land. And here we go, and we... Ooh, right on the 10 minutes we got there. 10 minutes!